Hello, Hello. sunshine. <laughs> Guys. Don't disturb. Wait, well, you didn't stop? I did. Okay. It says don't disturb. Oh. <laughs> don't stop. Okay, come in. Come in. Come in. Okay, come in. 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 We can, we can do a hot bath together. <laughs> to cut weight? Yeah, it'd be really disgusting. Make a horrible soup. Okay. Something in Arabic that I don't know what it is. Live, laugh, love, probably. Um, okay, so we are in Abu Dhabi. We just had a five and a half hour long nap. Five and a half hours? Four hours. Four hours of, of napping. I want to do more, but it's like six o'clock now so we need to go and train um and then what else train have something to eat and then hopefully go back to sleep i really hope we can sleep because i feel like absolute dog shit anyway let me show you the hotel room so i started unpacking already we have like four cases um so everything is kind of everywhere but i want to just like take all my stuff out and maybe come back <laughs> don't show <laughs> Look at me. Um, so yeah, this is the rest of the room. That's not really. That's kind of it. Yeah, here's uh, Gabrielle's pants. <laughs> More views. And uh, I hear are my pants and watching. Um, but yes, yeah, so we're gonna go train now, and I'll shut up. I'm delirious. And uh, yes, I've also got how much water retention? A kilo and a half ish. Yeah, a kilo and a half off the flight. And it's the week before my period, so like that combination just means I am like a buffalo, like a water buffalo, just retaining water. So I'm gonna go do a little workout, but I hear other people are also a, a bit heavy. So um, that always brings me a little bit of joy, because like we're gonna suffer together, dream, collectively. Um, but yeah, I'll shut up now. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>
so I'm filming in the sauna, <laughs> which I don't think it's a good idea. My phone is very, very hot, um, but I'm just gonna put it out in two seconds. I just wanna put some music on. Um, but yeah, I'm in the sauna. We've arrived in Abu Dhabi. We got here at about 12.30 by the time we, we landed and got our bags um, and got to the hotel and everything. The hotel is gorgeous has like a gym like a really proper gym not just like free weights it has like barbell and, and plenty of space to actually work out and good equipment um and obviously a sauna which is so nice um especially when you want to cut weight and stuff well i don't want to cut weight but when you need to it's nice to not have to worry um and also like we have a big bathtub in the room too so i've been to so many places like on shows where you turn up and they're like there's no tub and it's not even a sauna so it's like one or the other usually i'm happy with but this has both and it also has a cold plunge a big heated pool and loads of facilities that like you can get massage you get your nails done i'm getting my nails done tomorrow um so it's just really nice to have everything you need here and it's full board so we get breakfast lunch and dinner completely free which is really nice it's nice to be treated nicely <laughs> obviously um but i feel so tired we had a nap once we got in um but we tried not to sleep too long just because we must leave tonight and get into like the rhythm of being here um i think i'll sleep okay i'm very tired i'm like trying to keep myself awake um we don't have that much time before the event and i'm holding a little bit of water weight so we did a little workout we did some drills basically just some speed drills sorry where am i in this <laughs> Put me in. Here, here's the table that we can can leave our complaints. Yes, that Where is. is my, uh, demand there is phone. nobody here, so it's fine. A demand to be honest. <laughs> I'm the diva now. We've got a little omelet station. So what we can have? All we can have some eggs. <laughs> For what? For your diet? Yeah. Get some health, healthy foods. That's all you're gonna eat for the next three days. <laughs> Let's go. Okay guys, so we just went to the supermarket or grocery store if you're American um, and we picked up some things for our diet because we do have full board here and they are giving us like free meals but it doesn't always align with what we need to eat because we still have some weight to cut. So trying to avoid like a ton of sodium but like I'm not going to go completely salt free, it's not necessarily that big of a cut to do that but we're just trying to keep it as like, I don't know, clean as possible kind of thing. So we have 9,000 protein bars. Because <laughs> I picked up double. I don't think Gabrielle also picked up double. So we have a lot of these um, the Bear Bells, Fulfill, Irish brand. Um, so yeah, just low carb, low sugar, high protein. Fantastic. Um, I got a multivitamin because I don't have any here while I'm traveling. So I got that. I also got some extra stuff for weight cutting uh, just to like, get rid of the last bit of water retention that we picked up over the flight. And I do have my period end of this week perfectly lines up with the tournament which is great um so i've got some orange uh, vitamin c uh, like effervescent tablets i just put that in my water to help me pee a little bit more than usual just to get rid of that extra water tension and i also for the same reason picked up dandelion root now bear in mind obviously not a nutritionist so don't follow my advice i hope that's an obvious disclaimer but um yeah so i got some of this to help me pee more as well <laughs> don't laugh <laughs> Oh, and then for sleep, because we're both jet lagged, um, some more than others. Uh, but I've got chamomile tea as well to help us sleep before bed. And they also have like a bunch of teas here anyway, but chamomile is meant to help you sleep. I don't know if it does. And then we've got fruit, so fruits. Um, we've got watermelon, and we have bloobs, blueberries. What's the Portuguese word for blueberries? Michilio. You made that up, that's not me. There is no word. 
<laughs> this is Gabrielle's fruit that's actually mostly in the carrier bags. So it fell out. Uh, and then we got Greek yogurt, yogurt, maybe some Greek yogurt. The Greek yogurt, high protein. Um, and then to mix in with that, we've got Mel from Brazil. It's come all the way from Brazil, which I think might be illegal to bring food over, isn't it? No. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> I got my protein sponsor, so Podium. I brought it with me traveling. It's almost done at this point. <laughs> but um, it's also almost time to go home. So I've got protein. I've got electrolytes, also took this from home. So there's also Podium. Uh, hydro and salt, so BCAs and electrolytes. We have creatine, but I've stopped taking it this week because uh, it, it just, uh, you keep a little bit of extra water when you take creatine. It's not making you gain weight, but just for like the, the fact that we need to drop water this week and not take any creatine. Um, then we also have rice cakes, bananas, a thousand bananas. I got some almond milk because it's a little bit lower calorie than regular milk that I could put in my English breakfast tea uh, and coffee. And then what else? I think that's it. Oh, and I had this to help me. Touch what is that? <laughs> Ginger. She ain't shot? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and <laughs> I don't know. For weight cutting, when you're going to get to that dehydrated period of time, essential right so when you're sauntering or hot bathing get some gum it just makes you feel a bit more alive stop you can get that dry mouth well you'll still have a dry mouth depending on which weight you're cutting but it's nice sugar free and if Italian's watching look away I've got some sugar free candies what else you want here um yeah oh we got some salt for when we boil ourselves and yeah, that's pretty much it. Everything else will be done in the buffet. Done. <laughs> I know you enjoy the martial arts, but I, I want to ask you that, do you have a purpose for fighting? Do you have a message you like to deliver when you fight? Um, I think it's mostly like overcoming myself. I'd say that's my purpose. Uh, I've always been, I was always very shy when I was young. You wouldn't be able to tell now because I do not shy. <laughs> um, but I feel like for me, it was always sort of proving to myself what I could achieve. So I'd say that's my main thing because it was like the thing that brought me the most confidence. And again, it's also felt like something I was supposed to do. Um, so that's very corny. Cool. But like genuinely, it just feels like it's meant to be like doing jiu jitsu and like finding it. Um, and I feel like, yeah, I think now as I'm getting older, my purpose would be. I hopefully want to inspire more girls to get into the sport. Um, it's just been such a, a life change for me, not only as an athletic career, but also just the community that you build doing jiu-jitsu. So I'd love to hopefully inspire other girls who maybe would look at martial arts and wouldn't think it's for them because they're not, I don't think they don't fit into the stereotype that we perceive of martial arts. I'd really like to inspire more girls who maybe don't think it's for them to be like, oh, maybe, maybe it can be. Maybe I can be multifaceted as a person and, and do lots of different things. Hey, hello. Hey, ne? Oh, this one? Yep. Yep. I've put my snack in a cup because we don't have bowls. <laughs> so we got Greek yogurt, whey protein, peanut butter, and then some blueberries. And I'm just going to have this as a snack before we train.